Well, hello everybody out there in internet land. This is Chris from MajorLegacy.com with another exciting episode of Tober's Log. Going to be a little bit of a different episode today. Uh, it's going to be an uninterrupted, uh, unedited version of this video. Uh, a couple things. Uh, obviously, there is a lot of stuff going on in the world <laughs> and continues to go on in the world. Um, when it comes to the chatter this week uh, for Horror Nights, uh, you know, everything was basically dominated by, you know, this question of the what if uh, with this stupid virus um, and what and how it could actually affect the event. Um, you know, and I also kind of didn't really feel like talking about Horror Nights this week. I mean, there's a lot of there's all this stuff going on. You know, I mean, I am actually still working, so uh, I, I do still have to go to work. Um, and this week, uh, you know, was sort of, like I said, it was dominated by all this stuff and, and sort of like the craziness of, of getting stuff prepared to sort of shelter in place and, you know, not go outside and do the social distancing and all this other stuff. Uh, and uh, I almost did not do a video because uh, I, I didn't know if I was going to have the time to do one and I didn't know if I really even wanted to talk about this situation because... While there was some chatter about the what if could, you know, in terms of the event itself this week, um, most of the chatter turned to, you know, what does this mean for Horror Nights and what does this mean, how is, you know, how is the event going to be affected and so on and so forth. Um, I didn't want to talk about it because I, I don't want to be the guy that sort of, uh, you know, talks about it in one way or the other. I don't want to say that... Uh, you shouldn't worry, and I don't want to say that you shouldn't worry, because I think that there's there you should be on both sides. I think, uh, you know, the event is kind of already being affected as we speak. Um, announcement season uh, is is going to be different. <laughs> it's not going to be on the same timeline, probably, that we were originally going to be getting. So, uh, you know, so so there is that. Now, uh, how, how this could or could not affect the event going forward, uh, you know, I, I do think it's a little early to sort of, uh, really analyze uh, how this could or could not affect the event. Um, but I also think it would be foolish to, to think that this this won't have any effect on the event because the, 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 especially with the parks being closed, the longer uh, the park closures go on, uh, the more likely uh, stuff is going to be or look different than what could or could not have been coming for Halloween Horror Nights 30. As of this moment in time, I'm also one of these people that thinks that Let's not, let's not, uh, you know, let's not talk about Hornets right now. Let's focus on uh, what is, what is happening. Uh, focus on staying healthy, uh, doing your, your part to sort of uh, not uh, infect anybody, to do the social distancing, uh, you know, so on and so forth. So I'll go down to the parks and sort of record, you know, the, how empty the parks are. We know how empty the parks are. Uh, while it's fun to see that stuff. We know what it looks like. It's just a giant theme park with no people. Uh, you know, it is what it is. Um, I, you know, I, I just, I, I think that uh, while it's it's also healthy to to um, to uh, clear your mind of the event as well, uh, which is another reason why I wanted, to, I wanted to do the video because uh, I know that some people out there do enjoy watching me for some strange reason. So, uh, so, so there's that. Um, but I also wanted to be a little bit real uh, with it as well to, to, to uh, you know, because when it does come to this stupid virus, uh, you know, and how it affects the event, um, it is a little early, but I still think that there is, there is, um, uh, I won't say concern, but there is, um, uh, uh, there is room uh, to sort of uh, start looking at the future and how how this could potentially affect the event. And like I said, it already kind of it, it already kind of is when it comes to announcement season. Um, the announcements are not going to be, or the timeline is not going to be the same. <laughs> I mean, it's just probably not going to be the same. I think that's safe to assume uh, at this point. Uh, but yeah, it just it's just way too early, uh, you know, to 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 really 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 sort of grasp how this could be because we don't know what's going to happen. Uh, you know, in July, we, we, we have no idea. I mean, I have my suspicions that the parks are actually going to be closed longer uh, than, than what, you know, what they're, what they were initially saying. I believe Knott's, uh, Knott's Bay Farms out there in California, I think they put out a statement yesterday or the day before that they're actually going to be closed through mid-May. Um, and that, uh, that, that could be realistic here. So, I mean, like if the parks close or the parks remain closed uh, for, for longer, um, that could potentially have an impact. And, and I think it'd be stupid to just kind of dismiss somebody uh, or not think that this this whole situation might not have an impact on the event because it very well could. And it already kind of is with the with the announcements 
in my view. I think the announcement schedules is really kind of up in the air at this point. It is what it is. But I just really didn't want to talk about uh, Horror Nights uh, this week. I was focused on other things, um, you know, and uh, I, I just the conversation was just dominated by this notion uh, of the virus sort of, um, you know, affecting the event. And it very well could. Um, but I don't, like I said, I don't want to be the guy that says don't worry about it and the guy that says uh, no worry about it because I just, I just, I don't think that way. Uh, I think there's kind of a middle ground in there where uh, you have to take a more realistic approach to it. Be like, well, let's wait and see what happens because it very well probably could be affected. So, you know, how, how and what that would look like could, could, uh, could be different depending on uh, certain circumstances and situations. But, um, but like I said, the, basically all the chatter was just dominated by this. And it, it was, you know, I just, I just didn't want to really talk about it. <laughs> um, during all this, though, uh, I, I've, um, uh, I, I dabble here and there in the whole video game thing. I'm not good at video games. I do like to play video games. Um, uh, and uh, a couple years ago, uh, I started this thing with MLB The Show, uh, where I was creating players uh, to, to you know to go through the show as uh, with uh, using Horror Nights icons uh, and watching them go through uh, through the process. Um, I sort of started that again. I went out and I sort of you know bought the game again, uh, you know, and I'm, I'm dabbling in that again. Uh, I'll probably do some live streams on YouTube here and there, uh, so you see the progression. The first character is Jack the Clown or Jack Schmidt. Um, so there there is that uh, going on. I just don't know, until all this stuff blows over, I don't know, uh, you know, what and how often I will be doing the videos at this point because I am still working as well, so uh, I do still have to work <laughs> during all this. Uh, so who knows, you know, that's sort of, you know, the mental strain on that is, is sort of there as well, and the, you know, the fact that I'm also working. Uh, so, uh, and I'm lucky enough to be working, of course. I know there's a lot of people that, are, that have lost their jobs uh, or are about to lose their jobs. It's gonna be a tough time here. <laughs> the next couple of months. So um, so that's why, you know, I just don't feel like really talking about Hornets right now. Uh, but you can look for that stuff. If I don't get the videos up uh, every week, um, you know, there is that. Uh, but yeah, you know, once again, uh, you know, just leaving this, you know, nobody panic. Uh, just let it, let this all play out. Please, I say again, don't be dicks to people. Uh, do not be a racist. Do not be a xenophobe. Uh, you know, help those in need. Uh, those that need help, um, those who cannot, um, you know, go out to the stores, uh, all that stuff. Stop hoarding toilet paper. Let's not do that anymore. Uh, <laughs> let us not do that anymore, please. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, so um, just be nice to people. Don't be a dick. Uh, continue to not be a dick. Uh, be nice people. Um, and I think that's it. That's all I wanted to say. Because, um, uh, I mean, the really, like I said, the conversation was just dominated by all this cur this this fucking virus and I just I just you know didn't you know want to harp on it too much but um, I still wanted to commit to making a video if I could so uh, so there is that but um, but anyway guys stay safe out there hopefully things will get back to normal within the next month or two uh, hopefully shorter <laughs> but uh, uh, but that's it so I'll talk to you guys later uh, bye <laughs>